Dean, an excellent 2-1 win tonight. Your thoughts? Listen, good performance first half. Um, should have had a more emphatic scoreline at half time. Obviously, hit on the break, a little bit of discipline from us, from sort of an attacking corner. Um, but all in all, look, I'm just delighted with the victory. I know Tuesday night games are very difficult, and it's always good to bounce back after the after the defeat at the weekend. So that's a sign of a good side. Um, just before we start talking about the game itself, you had Dale Gorman, Nicky Kamara, and Danny Collins all back into the start eleven, and also Idris Khan who coming on in the second half. How delighted are you to have all them back? Yeah, and we had Laurie back as well. Laurie come back into the team. So a lot of them have been out for a long time. I think Nicky's been eight weeks. Uh, we haven't seen Danny since Christmas, basically, uh, and Gorman since been out for three months or so. All in all, it's, uh, it's, I'm just delighted to have them out, uh, have them back. The key players, which you could see, they were sort of blowing towards the end and. Uh, to be fair to our supporters, they drove us home. We needed them tonight. We really did in the late stages of the game. Um, Laurie made a couple of brilliant saves for us. Um, and obviously, Id's come on and did some good ball carrying in the wide areas. And I thought we lacked that at different times. But I just couldn't put Id's on too early. And I had to take Danny off as well. He, he played probably 15 minutes more than would have liked. I just don't want to take risks with key players for us. But look, we've got to get the job done first and foremost. We've got to cement our, our position. We're in, we're in the division. Um, but in all in all, look, it is a good night, a really good night for us. Uh, one of those players that came back, Dale Gorman, with the first goal, an absolutely terrific goal. Great for him to come back from injury and have a performance like that he did tonight. Yeah, Gorman was a real leader. He's a character. He's huge around the camp. Um, even when he's not playing, he's you know, you know helping out around the place and good vibes. He's you know he's always smiling and playing gags and stuff like that. That's why he's our captain. Um, I thought it was a fantastic goal, wasn't it? Great first touch and then sort of, it seemed like a bit of a half volley to me. And uh, with his left foot as well, so nice to see and I'm delighted for him. Another excellent goal, Gatlin O'Donka, a good performance from him tonight. Yeah, Gat's a strong player physically, he wants to feel people in that. Still got to improve on his movements. Um, at times he gets himself too square on with, with, uh, with defenders. He needs to see numbers better and run off the blind side. Um, but he's still learning the game, you know, he's a very young boy. Uh, he's only 19, you've got to remember, he's a, but he's a strong boy, but a fantastic volley, good finish, he kept it alive and uh, I'm delighted for him as well. You mentioned as well, Walker made some good saves today. For a keeper, a lot of the game is about the mentality of it. When you're out for the, like, the last few months not playing, how important was it for him to come in and be sharp and uh, put in the performance he did today? Yeah, look, listen, I know Laurie a long time. I think like, that's Laurie's 400 and toward game and he's played 281 for me when I'm his manager, so he knows how I am. Um, and obviously he found himself out in the cold a little bit and he's kept his head down, kept his nose clean and he's got on with it. And the one thing with Laurie, he walks his socks off. Uh, he's in great nick for his age. I think he's 24 now. Um, and he, he looks after himself really, really well. And I thought tonight when he had to make a couple of crucial saves, he made a good one with his left hand, down to his left hand side. That was a good save when Quigley got away from us. Um, and he made another good save where he smothered as well, to be fair to him. So, look, it was a good performance for him and he's an experienced player, but it's nothing I don't know already. I know, I know Laurie's standards and uh, I thought he was, he was really good for us tonight. And the games keep coming. Back at the Hive on Saturday, a big game against Dorkin. How's this next few days going to look for you in the group? Yeah, look, I don't know how steady he got on tonight with England C. It'll be interesting to see. Do you know how he got on? Yeah, uh, he came off. Steady. He came off. Did he score? No. Did they win? No. OK, that's the way it goes. All right, so not the greatest experience for him. And he got booked as well. well that doesn't surprise me. Um, but look, we're, we're proud of Steady getting called off. And see, it shows we're doing the right things and we're signing the right players. Um, so that's gone on tonight. So we'll see how he comes back from there. Um, hopefully we'll have Freeman back from illness. Get some players back. We just need some players back. You know, it's 17-year-old and the 16-year-old on the bench tonight. So um, we won't have... We won't have Josh back, so Laurie will stay in the sticks. And if I'm being totally honest with you, like I've said to Laurie, I ain't going to lie. If Laurie performs like he did tonight, he'll stay in the team. So we've got two fantastic goalkeepers. Um, and if he performs like that, we've got no issues whatsoever. He'll, he'll stay in the team uh, for the foreseeable. And that's how football works, I'm afraid. Uh, one door opens, another one closes, or the other way around. You know, one door closes, another one opens. So, But look, the main thing for us is we've got to be at it. I know Mark's teams. They will come at us. They'll play four up front. They'll come after us. And I love. I think our games are brilliant. The last game we found ourselves two 0 down. Then it was. Then we, we managed to win the game three two. And they're obviously fighting for their lives. They've got a lot of good players. And I think Mark's a brilliant character for the game. I really do. Um, I'm really fond of him. We speak quite a lot, to be fair. Uh, he likes the same voice notes, but we speak quite a lot. And uh, we're looking forward to the game. It's another good challenge for us. Um, it'll be a different challenge tonight. They won't sit off us the way Eastley did. They'll come after us. So let's see. Can we? Uh, we jumped our hurdle on Saturday. Dean, congratulations and thank you for your time.